and we're up and going. <laughs> Welcome to Conference Update with Brian and Donna Lynn. I'm Brian today, and you're still Donna Lynn. And uh, hey, how are you doing? I'm great. Yeah, you are. <laughs> I can't complain. Right? Yeah, good. Uh, let's see. Last night, what were we doing? We were at a local conference. Yes. Together. Yes. Uh, we don't. I don't normally go. I haven't been this year, but to, I did last night. Because? Because it was with the Sweet Home people and Sodaville, <laughs> and I, I just wanted to say hi. Yeah, and we had supper with Winston. Oh, my goodness. Who's great. Yes. Uh, love I love that guy. I love Winston. And, yeah, had supper with Winston. Where we were at Sodaville and had Sweet Home and Sodaville churches together for a local conference, and I had meetings with the peeps just for them to tell me how great their pastors are. I and, had meetings uh, too. You had meetings too. Except Everybody mine were had more fun. Yours were a lot. Well, <laughs> it wasn't really a meeting. I don't know. <laughs> Ours were more pretty was, fun too. I was just entertaining those you who were just around having me. Having a good time. <laughs> Yeah, and so, but we got to go down to see Sweet Home People, and it was great. Yes. Uh, last Sunday, we were at Salem. Oh, my goodness. That was so fun. <laughs> I just loved being there. It felt so homey, actually. Yeah. I mean, I know we're visiting different churches all the time, but really felt very homey, welcoming. Yeah. I kind of want to go back we had a good sunday <laughs> at salem and it was great oh it was awesome yeah. Yeah. worship was great and yeah they they laughed at a couple of my jokes but you I know gonna, it's i was good. gonna say the preacher was pretty good looking uh, yeah yeah it was me uh <laughs> just to make it clear and uh yeah so we had a good time at salem we did um somebody did call me randy there so you know that's right? normal <laughs> butler yeah, Randy Butler. I go other places. They call me Randy because the last superintendent's name was Randy. So it's fine. It's just how it is. Hey, you know. Now I want a side by side of you and, and Randy Butler. I just want to see, you know. Yeah, that's okay. What everyone else sees. Right. Oh, well. But that's cool, though. Yeah. Yeah. Because we like Randy. Right? Yeah. 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 You know, they aren't calling me Brad Pitt or anything, but it's. <laughs> <laughs> wow wow sorry you're my brad pitt <laughs> yeah thanks <laughs> i'm tearing up it's really quite so funny. anyway we had a great time at salem sunday the church is doing well and uh oh let's see and then last saturday was at new harmony and had a good yeah. time there and barbecue and stuff and uh let's yeah, life just keeps moving on here, heading up to Bend this weekend. Yeah. And uh, so go see New Hope Church. They do, you know, Brandon's such a, he's a great preacher, and they're doing such great ministry there at Bend. And mm -hmm. so I haven't been able to be there on a Sunday morning yet, so looking forward to doing that. And, um, oh, let's see, you you, uh, you were doing things over the weekend, too. I was. We kind of went our own directions Friday, Saturday, right. hung out with some friends on Friday, and then I was in Corvallis with our daughter on Saturday. They uh, they just moved across the hall to a, a bigger <laughs> apartment, and so, you know, moms are really good at cleaning. Busy being a mom. <laughs> so that's what I did, mm -hmm. help clean and organize a little bit, but we conquered. Yeah, so, good for you. So that was kind of fun and discovered muscles that I forgot I owned had you're so strong <laughs> I don't know about that. <laughs> but it was a good day i ended yeah. up coming back home i was contemplating staying overnight but i'm like eh, i uh, think staying in my own bed will be great it doesn't matter if i'm coming great. from corvallis or from gladstone either way i gotta travel to salem so i decided yep. my own bed so all right cool. so yeah it was, yeah. It, was, it, was, it was great had a good oh. time now today is wednesday may 1st Yes. Tomorrow, yeah, it's May. I'm I know. Freaking out. Yeah. Uh, tomorrow is National Day of Prayer. It is. And uh, so, yes, it's. Uh, I kind of, you know, I look at it as: do you do you feel like you know our nation needs more prayer or less prayer? I, I, not a hard question. I, yeah, not a hard question. <laughs> I, I would say more. I would say more. And uh, tomorrow's the day. Uh, first Thursday in May is always National Day of Prayer Day. 
uh, and there's prayer events going on all over the place. Yep. Um, it's uh, it's fun just to see the new pastor at Sweet Home getting involved, and here's how things work here in Sweet Home. They've done a lot of um, oh prayer things around town during the day. Yeah, at and, different times. Uh, and so yeah, yeah so. I, I should have checked with Jesse to find out what you know if he's leading one of those. I always led the one at City Hall, uh, which was kind of fun. You just mm -hmm. you know pray there at City Hall. Um, in Salem, they're doing a yeah. yeah. They're going to the Capitol. Yeah, there's a big deal. It's not just our our church, but no. it, it's a big deal at yeah. Salem at the Capitol. I think seven o'clock uh, tomorrow evening. And so it's supposed to be a nice day tomorrow and to pray in front of the Capitol, which there's all kinds of crazy protests and stuff in this world and like you know how about we go and instead of yelling for things we we actually pray uh for our our state and our country and uh so good stuff mm -hmm. uh because oh yeah we need more prayer not less prayer yeah um, definitely yeah and uh, so National Day of Prayer coming up, and then I get to do road trip, and then I've got meetings next week, and life just keeps moving on. Well, and just to kind of fit in with you know National Day of Prayer, mm -hmm. we have Pastor's Prayer coming up right. here at the conference office. I believe the following Thursday. I think it's Thursday. a week from tomorrow. Yeah, yeah, we'll do a Pastor's Prayer tomorrow, or a week from tomorrow. Yes. Yep, and uh, so that's coming up. We, we just, we need more prayer, and... Um, yeah, yeah. So That's just just an automatic thing. Right. And guess what else is coming up? I don't know. You should know. I should know. Mother's Day's coming oh, up. Oh, Mother's Day's coming up. Right. Yeah. 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 That's kind of cool. Yeah. It's always exciting. M Mother's Day's coming up a week from Sunday. So, yeah, don't don't miss out on Mother's Day. Uh, a week from Sunday? A week from Sunday. Sunday is the wow. 5th. Is the Cinco de Mayo. And then uh, the next Sunday after that is Mother's Day on the 12th. Time is yeah. flying by. Right? Yes. Yeah. Yes. Yeah. So So there you go. Oh, yeah. It's just been it's just been full. It's full, it's nonstop and yeah, all kinds of uh, good stuff uh, going on. Mm -hmm. And um, yep, we uh, let's see. Oh, we threw out a few more things here at the conference office. Um, I don't think we have a fax machine around here. We might. I, I don't think we know. Do. I don't know if anybody even we does faxes anymore. Uh, but we there were like stamps uh, <laughs> that you stamp on on things just to let you know if it's been faxed, um, which was really cool twenty years ago when we were faxing things. I guess, but uh, probably don't need it. So it's pretty cool. We're having fun. Yeah, going yeah. through corners. Just. Uh, it's, you know, this made sense 20 years ago at the old conference office, but we're not going to use this now. So we're trying to do a little bit of spring cleaning. It's great. Yes. Yeah. Yeah. But we're not getting rid of the tie that uh, Josh Shelton gave oh, me. That's, no. that's definitely a keeper. I want you to wear it I'm, I, <laughs> Just once. Josh desperately wants me to wear you know, it when when you... next time I'm at Park Place. Exactly. Yeah, so. I think you should. That's coming up uh, two weeks from Sunday. I'll be at Park Place, so I'll be there in the evening. And yeah, yeah I, I feel I, like on a on a morning. Kind uh, yeah, of time. I feel like a tie is not really. Uh, it's not really evening thing. It's yeah, a little more casual. Yeah, it's more casual, more formal. Yeah. So tie, I'll give you a pass this time. Of course, but next that time. that tie. Oh, I don't know. We'll see. I just I don't know if I can pull it off. Um, I. You know what? I think you can. I just I don't have a lot of self confidence to pull off a crazy tie, so. Yeah, and uh, so let's see. Oh, last week uh, there was a big pastors thing here in Portland, and um, so it was it was a pretty good deal. Uh, Keith Dickerson and I went to that, and they threw in lunch with the deal, and we ate uh, the Lord's uh, lunch there. We had Chick Fil A. <laughs> <laughs> was wondering yeah. where you were going yes, with that. Yes, it was great. We had Chick-fil-A. So that just, yeah. Nice. Yeah. And then uh, Keith and I kind of missed the after lunch session or half of that because, mm. you know, we were chatting with people and then oh. talking and then it's, uh, well, now I need to eat my sandwich. And um, 
this is what happens when you're with Keith Dickerson. <laughs> you're having a good time. No, and, no, oh, it's wait just, a minute. It's going. Uh. Wait, I just would like to say that's pastors in general. Pretty much. Because yeah. like, yeah. Yeah. yeah, no, that's just a pastor thing. Yeah. Like, we can't throw so. anyone under the yeah. bus on no, this. No, it, it is. Yeah. I talked with a kid uh, Sunday and um, yeah, you know, so what's it like with your grandpa being, you know, being, being the grandson of that guy? He says, eh, sometimes it's waiting for him to be done talking to people. <laughs> Oops. <laughs> uh, a little too hard, close to home. So, yeah. All right. Hey, we better wrap this thing up and uh, National Day Prayer tomorrow. We need to be praying for our country, be praying for our, our conference of churches here. Mm -hmm. And, um, It'd be praying for our pastors. Uh, we have mm -hmm. pastors that are just, you know, they're doing, some of them are doing great ministry. Some of them are doing good ministry, but struggling. And, yeah. and some churches are doing well. Some churches, I mean, life just happens. And mm -hmm. so uh, yeah. be praying for our group of churches. This is why we have prayer calendars and things. And uh, Especially those in, in pastor search mode. Scripture calls us to pray for one another. Mm -hmm. So let's do that. So anyway, hey, see you guys next time. Bye-bye.